וכל בנייך למודי השם ורעב שלוים בנייך. אל תיקי בנייך אלא בוי נייך. All my children that are limudi Hashem learn Teda. Virav Shloim, there's a lot of peace. By learning Teda. So in general, we see part of Shalom Nafshi, it's all three. And you could have all three. We know that davening, it's like a ladder that goes down, Mutzav Arza, and it can be even lower than Eretz, and go even higher than Shemayim. That is davening. You connect to Hashem, and you go higher and higher and higher. So that's the idea of tefillah. You have gemilas chasadi. You have gemilas chasadim also. Your mechaya, you enlivened so on that uh, that was in a bad situation. But Teda is the one that brings peace. Now if you look at davening, davening is a war. Davening is a cherev. It's a sword. Like we know that the psuki zimra, the zamra ritzim, to cut twigs. It comes from a cherev. But that could be a chet of shal shalom. It could be a sword of shalom. What is the sword of shalom? That really has nothing to do with you. He might be going to a different city. They might just be passing by you. And that's why it says, even a chet of shal shalom, a sword of peace also should not be within you. But that is davening. But Sakhar Shal Shalim. And the reason for that is it's not made to fight the Yetzahara or to fight the darkness. It has to do with it has to do with revealing the Nefashali kiss. Taylor, on the other hand, is a Baderha Mela thing. It's not even a war. By learning Taylor, you bring peace into the world. That means without swords, without guns. And that's why Taylor says, or that's why we say, that Taylor brings peace in the world. Because over there, there's not even a Cherev Shoshalim. And we see also that um, Drashbi, that he was Tehrasi Um Nasai, that Tehra was his whole occupation. We see by Drashbi the same idea. Drashbi said that I can be part of the whole world from Din. Part of the whole world from Din, that's the idea of the Din and Mitzarim to create the world. So you go much higher by learning Teda. Like it says, when you learn Teda, you unify with Hashem. The Noisna Teda. And there's no unity greater than that. And that's why we see that even though it says, Kayam, on three things the world exists with, Allah Teda Aveda Gmils Chasadim. And also, call Isaac by Teda. Teda is the first thing. So, this idea of it, Avedis Hashem, 
that everything is equal. You learn Teda, you do Gmiras Chasadim, you Daven also, but that is not, that is Ha'ilam Kayam. But to make a new world, that is through Teda. Because as we know, the aim is to create the world with Teda. So that's why we continue with Bainayuch that they build the world. The Tamidi Chachamim build a world. And that's by learning Teda the way you're supposed to. With Bitul Ta'akadosh Baruch and everything else. So by learning Primus HaTeda, we come to the Gili Alikus when Mashiach comes. Because Primus HaTeda speaks about God. And Be'ez Hashem will go towards Mashiach even before Shabbos. Today, Chaf Aleph Kislev, Ach Toi Chesed. Chaf Aleph is that only good and kindness will befall us. And the true good is Mashiach Tzidkeinu. Long live our master, teacher, and Rebbe King Mashiach forever and ever. Long live our master, teacher, and Rebbe King Mashiach forever and ever. Long live our master, teacher, and Rebbe King Mashiach forever and ever.